state for an hour, but they refused. After a while, most of them alighted from the truck and we were shocked to see them with cutlasses. With a ban on interstate travel imposed by the federal government to stem the tide of coronavirus pandemic, the Nigerian police have had their hands full trying to enforce the order. This time, security officials intercepted a truck loaded with more than 200 people along the Lagos Ibadan Expressway. We have details in this report. Thousands of vehicles ply the ever busy Lagos Ibadan Expressway daily. It is one of the routes many find their way into the nation's commercial capital. On this day, TVC News crew noticed first and the unusual. A truck loaded with people in the face of a lockdown. But it didn't pass the Eagle High police officers and other security agents who intercepted it. The driver of the truck says he doesn't know the people, even though they were picked up at different states on his way from Casina to Lagos. Motor park boys brought the passengers to me to assist them on their journey. They joined my vehicle at different parks on the road, so I decided to help them. Some of them joined me in a lorry. It is just to assist them. He also claims not knowing anything about the existence of the interstate lockdown by the federal government. There is movement on Fridays and Sundays. That is what people say. The police say they have asked them to return to their state for an hour, but they refused. After a while, most of them alighted from the truck and we were shocked to see them with cutlasses. An hour turned two hours, but the security agencies didn't back down and insisted that they go back to Casina. They were not the only vehicle. Some others, not on essential duty, were turned back. The police say the interstate lockdown is still in effect and directed by the Presidential Tax Force to curb the spread of the COVID-19.